Hi, it's Adam with Outdoor uh, Bushcraft. Just want to give you guys what's going on today. Today we're finishing the tripod shelter, getting the front walls up. We should have all that done uh, by this afternoon. So look forward to all these videos. I look forward to getting this shelter done. I'm out here with uh, Jeremiah's <laughs> and Jeremy. I keep on saying his name wrong. <laughs> But uh, we're out here just having some fun, bushcraft fun. Got the fire going a little bit. Little Jeremy's over there playing with the fire, so he's uh, the fire keeper. So we're, we're just getting out and getting it knocked out for you today. So if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, please do. Like the videos, comment. Go back and watch all the tripod shelter bills. And enjoy the show. So today we're putting up the front walls.
So basically, as you guys have seen, we're uh, we got like uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. As you can see, uh, we got one wall completed on the front. Uh, we've got it progress. We're progressing in this uh, tripod build. We're really down to the last uh, other side over there, and then we have to make a custom door. But the custom door is not getting made probably today with the time frame and stuff like that. But we are almost completed. <laughs> Six months, a lot of hard work, uh, but you know what they say, hard work pays off. So it's perseverance. So anything you do, any projects you do yourself, with your family or friends or anything like that, if you're out on your own property doing stuff, don't get discouraged. Uh, the project will get done eventually. Um, like I said, bushcraft is all about having fun. It's learning skills that you might never have to use, but just the fact that you might have these skills and be able to use them one day if the situation ever arises that's what it's all about and that's what it's all about for me that's why I said this channel is uh, beginner mode to expert mode I'm, I'm figuring in another year or two I should have a lot more skill set so and if you and your family or friends do stuff like this you'll build up your skill set I mean it's, a lot of this is fun it's a lot of hard work but it's worth it all right got Jeremiah over here he's working on some bushcraft He's made a spear. Now he's using Mordecai knife. He's getting all the bark off. We chopped the knobs off, the little uh, knots that stick out. So he's having fun, aren't you? Yeah. Uh, it's pretty fun. You just need to like enjoy nature. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes you get. A little bored at times but you get out here and get working a little bit once you get into it it's not bad so he's doing that well uh, and keeping the fire going over there and um, me and big Jeremiah Jeremy whatever he wants to be called <laughs> are, are finishing up the tripod shelter um, got this side all done solid now we're over here on this side I'm gonna finish up uh, this side 
you know, be complete other than getting the door done. The door is probably something we're going to customize and make make it ourselves. It's definitely going to be bushcraft, so. But I uh, just want to show some progress. We added an extra step to get up in there. Like I said, this is going to see, um, give you a view from this side. In here, the bottom, we made it out to be like bunk bed. And then there's another bunk bed right there. Um, and then in this corner, we were talking about putting a custom chair in there. And you could also lay some other stuff down in there. And um, definitely want to have something to lay on top of other than those sticks. It's not going to be that comfortable. So we got a lot of uh, gaps. We're going to have to fill in the gaps a little bit. So we'll probably do that at a later date. All right. Finishing up the last pieces. Getting in here. Where there's the wedge in the wood, it's because the wood is too thick and we had to wedge it in order to get it screwed down. Jeremy's getting the last couple pieces screwed in there. We even got a little door handle here. Or uh, when you walk up, step up those two, put your hand in there, pull yourself in. And this side will have the door swinging to the right. So, this is all pretty much done, other than the door. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed this build. I'm sorry it took so long. We're getting it, uh, finally getting it done now. Like I said, I'll swing over to the back side, show you the back side. Sorry about the camera angle. It's all the way done up there. Down there, we're gonna put the tarp on, tarp it, so we can get access to the, putting stuff underneath the shelter. Come around this big tree here. Walls are all done on this side. There's some gaps. Uh, we'll have to figure out the gaps and stuff. We got that covered up down there. There are some gaps in the shelter. Uh, we're gonna try to figure out what we're gonna do for the gaps. But like I said, for the most part, the structure is solid. Good job. Young Buck was at the beginning. <laughs> and he's here at the end. He's got a good fire over there. He's kept the fire going pretty good for us all day, burning some stuff. So. Like, like I said, this is something you guys can do out in your woods. You just find th three trees. Like I said, these are three trees. You put a border all the way across, made a triangle, built the floor up on top of the triangle, and just went up. We actually talked the other day about maybe putting another section on top of it, going up a little bit more. I think that would be pretty cool, but it was a nice talk about it, but we didn't, I don't think we want to long as it took to build this part I don't think we want to go up and do another section so well thanks for watching to the end of the video today um, today we got the tripod shelter pretty much 95% completed so and uh, Jeremiah he had fun he made him a nice little spear do some bushcraft so it's it's all about having fun you know we have been working on this project for a long time you guys have seen the different videos it's been probably about I think eight videos uh, this shelter is very complex but uh, we finally got it done like I said 95% done so we got the door to do and the chair inside but other than that she's ready for some overnighters and uh, sometime this either summer or fall you'll see an overnighter out here um, but I do have to work on the A-frame shelter. That's going to take about another month. You know, if I get help, it'll go quicker. But if not, I'll get it done myself. So, uh, like I said, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do that. Like all the videos. Watch all the way through the video. It helps. And always, thank you for watching. Be kind to each other and be safe.